time for another audit. Out here to uh, exercise our First Amendment constitutional rights, freedom of the press, to uh, document, record in public spaces, publicly accessible areas, and public employees and see what level of service they provide or don't provide to the taxpayers that pay their salary. Let them live their lives. Uh, today, August 11th, or excuse me, August 12th, Friday, we're going to uh, the Nevada Department of Public Safety Parole and Probation. Go see how they uh, treat me. I'm gonna ask for a copy of their budget and a public records request and uh, get to it, see what they do for us. So here we go. Okay. We're here in Valley, Valley Road in Reno, Nevada. It's next to the Schnitzer Scrapyard. Like some more schnitzer stuff next to us here. The camera's up there. Yeah, this is the scrapyard still here. <clears throat> the ideal situation is if none of them engaged, we just got our public information request and left. So here we are. 475 Valley Road, Public Safety, Parole and Probation. What do we got here? Walking around, got a nice fenced off area. authorized personnel only. It's a big building here they got. It looks like a cop car there. A bunch of cop cars out to see it. A bunch of cop cars inside. And what is this? August of 2022. So they're almost expired here. This one's December, this one's September, nice, uh oh, what do we have here, there's an expired tag, I wonder what's up with that, May of 2022, interesting. That doesn't look like a government car though really, so maybe our state's okay, old Ford Fusion. November on this one, April 2023 on this one. Wonder when that one expires, August 2022. And the one next to it's December. Any other cars that are looking like they're Flags are flying, and no wind today. Let's see what they got on the door here. In case of inclement weather, late and opening, state of Nevada, hours, no firearms allowed, no children allowed. All visitors are required to check in once daily. 
any secure areas. So you gotta check in before you access secure areas. Report directly to reception. Fees may be mailed. Protect this house. Are you sick? Stay at home. Okay, let's go see if they got a uh, copy of their budget. What's this here? Monthly report forms. No clothing to be. All offenders will report with appropriate attire. So offenders have a dress code. Shirts, blouses, arm holes and shirts, appropriate undergarments. Sucks when the government's got to tell you to wear underwear. Strapless, spaghetti straps, no spaghetti straps for the girls. Muscle shirts not for, what is a muscle shirt? Shorts and skirts will be at least mid-length. Clipboards, pencils, please return them. Public records request. Here we go. Fees for copies of public records of the Department of Public Safety Division of Parole and Probation are available in the following locations. It may also be found out. So does that mean I can't do a public records request here? So I've got to go to Carson City at 555 right away. Let's go ask. Volunteers needed free drug and alcohol treatment. Technical, a scale of one to ten. Come see us. There are many good places for you to bring your children. However, parole and probation office is not one of them. Children are not allowed in this facility. Missing now hiring the Lord and Lord careers. Power of second chances. I believe in that. ABC details, suicide prevention. Ready to make some money. Learn a new trade, join our team. Hi there. Hi. Do you have a public information request form? Public information request form? Yes. I don't have a form like that. To do a public information request? No. But, uh, I've never heard of a form like that. It's uh, NRS 239, and it uh, allows the public to request information from the government. From the government? Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you very much.
Yeah, I know. I haven't it. So wait a minute to the video when she's going to get the information. Yeah. Subject to search in this building. That's an interesting law. I'll have to read that law. 171.1232. Are you recording that? Yes. Let's step outside because, um... What, what's your name, sir? What? what? What's your name, sir? No, I'm not going to give it to you. Oh. Can you please step outside with that camera? Oh, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm, I'm waiting for information for a public information so request. you're asking for government. Information. Okay, so we're, so where, where would the public? Right, right. Um, I'm I'm just working under what the law tells me I can, which is a, a public information request is all that I'm trying to do. So I just want public information. Right, I'm looking for budgets, revenues, Got it. Okay. All, all of that me, stuff. Can you give me a second? Let me get your email address. Where I, we don't have a form, but I can get okay. an email address. Okay, I appreciate it. Thank you. Here's a form. It's okay. from our department's website, the huh. Department of Public Safety. Okay. We do have a records form. I printed you the hard version, but if you go over to our website, you can also submit it online. Okay. I and appreciate then, your time. Yeah, you can request all sorts of information about what we do here, if you need budgetary information. Um, as well, I, I mentioned you, I heard you mention budget. You can also go right. to the Nevada Legislature and see Department of Public Safety, Pro Probation, Highway Patrol budget. Okay. Okay. So it's under Highway Patrol, not State Police? Uh, they, no, they confused it when they, the they, they confused it when the, the Democrats changed you guys to be in the police since they wanted to get rid of the police. It was kind of confusing. Yeah, so it was a name change. So we're yeah. still Nevada Department of Public Safety, but yeah, state police. Yeah, they, they added that extra word in there. It was, in, it was interesting. I, I appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, have a good day. You too. was a good one. There was only one guy that told me not to record. And, uh, well, he didn't do anything, and the officer we dealt with, he was very professional. Could have asked him his name, his badge number, but there was no confrontation, and, well, I was the one engaging them, so. In my opinion, you get more uh, bees with honey, and I'm not out here trying to make them fail. I want them to fail themselves, that's my goal. So if they uh, succeed when I'm being kind, that's not a bad thing. The world needs some more kindness. Anyways, like I said, pretty good audit here. Is that another government? Yeah, it's a government car. It's got a cage in the back. Let's go check its tags. Yep, September of 2022. Oh, this one's May, but this one could be May of 2022, so he's expired. 